There are everyday homes, and there are homes with a little something extra. I'm Kelly Ellis, designer, artist, and lifelong traveler. I've been fortunate enough to see some truly incredible places in every corner of the world. But now I'm gonna take you with me behind the doors of some seriously phenomenal homes. From custom bowling alleys to sprawling car galleries, from skybox lounges to bespoke personal resorts and more. We're gonna take a deep dive into the world of absolutely, fabulously, utterly extravagant home design. This is Extravagant Spaces. Okay. <laughs> that was a little walk up the hill, right? Where are we? Well, we're on the side of a mountain, looking now at the mountains versus up at the mountains. Incredible. I'm, I'm so excited. This is so different. Totally different. You know, we always do a lot of traditional transitional homes, but we also do a fair share of modern contemporary homes. I cannot wait to see what this looks like. You're going to love this. We carved this right into the side of a mountain, so. Literally. Let's go check it out. Okay. <laughs> We are. Hello. Kelly, oh, meet wow. the interior designer, Anita Lang. Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you, Kelly. So nice to meet you. Mm, welcome. Thank come you. Come on in. Cool off. Yes. Yes, come wow. on in that sun. <laughs> How does okay. that feel? Well, wonderful to be inside. Um, and also, I just am taking in the first thing that strikes me is this gorgeous art piece, installation. Wow. Yeah, right? Good eye, Kelly. That's one of my favorite pieces in the house, too by a Polish artist, Wolski. It's incredible. Yeah. This whole entrance is incredible, but you just can't help it. This is really, this is a different level. This is a different side of you. Different, uh, there's a lot of sides to me, right, Anita? There are a lot of sides to my friend, Mark. Yeah, so this, this sure. house was all about the view. So we're up here. We wanted to make sure this house was positioned from every possible space to get that view. Absolutely. But we have a surprise, because there's also, also the back side of the mountain, and we took advantage yeah. of that here also. Of, of course you did. Okay, welcome to the great room. Wow, this is great. Right? It is great. What incredible. I... Right. Both sides. Both sides. <laughs> wow. Yeah, so we have the mountain view on this side, but we also wanted to take into account we're on a mountain. And so we opened this side of up to the cut of the mountain. So it, look at the fresh air that just breezes through here. And you feel this great connectivity all the way through. A hundred percent. And I think it's really unique to have such an intimate experience yes. with a mountain like this. Yes. A along with a vast view. That right. does not happen very often. It makes this very special. And one of our goals in this, when you have a view like this, when you have great architecture, is to really be simple in your mm, choices. Mm -hmm. And really our mantra was luxury is simplicity. And so we dialed back, we used really authentic materials and you can see how we used them indoor outdoor because that's what this whole story is about, right? It's merging. Yeah, if you're merging indoor with outdoor. Nature. I am outdoor really blown away. I mm -hmm. really am blown away. I Thank can't, it's it really, it's incredible. It's so beautiful. It, it really does feel warm, like you said, right? With the materials, you do feel intimate. I can't believe what you had to do to, to build this house here. We had to chip away and then bolt the mountain in place so it wouldn't come down on us. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, right. it's basically pin cushioned into the mountain. Literally, literally. You, this, this house is just nestled in here. It's so, so gorgeous. It's all about the views, clearly. Wow. Just, Boy, we wow. have a little extra to show you. He always does. Always a little more. <laughs> he always <laughs> does. Here we are in the Desert Botanical Zen Garden. I feel very zen right now. Don't you? Isn't this great? It's gorgeous. And this merges right into the dining room, which is right off this spectacular water feature. Wow. Wow. Out, in, out, in, Yeah, the you don't same. know where it, where it stops and starts, no. right? It's so El Fresco dining in a way, right? Yeah, You're this so is connected your porch, but it's also your dining room. And once again, we captured that spectacular view of Camelback Mountain just through that little opening. So you, even on this side of the house, you still see Camelback. Unbelievable. Okay, so are you ready to go see something a little extra extra? Always. This is Always. where I made my famous paella dinner. Let's ah, go. That <laughs> mark. <laughs> Okay, so here we are in my favorite room of this house. Obviously, right? The what, kitchen. What an amazing space. 
Really? More of the view. Really? The Plenty kitchen's gorgeous. And when you have a space this large, the way to really keep it cozy is this really large, overscaled double island with the two different materials. And then the simplicity of the cabinetry behind it in the wool gray. everything clean. Clean, simple, everything has He wanted has it clean, place. right? Exactly. Here we are in the primary suite. Wow. And again, we kept the size of this room very intimate. You as know, you do. As yes. you notice, this, this size is pretty much my template. It really is. And what I always thought was amazing about this space is you feel like you're in this little bird's yeah. nest <laughs> overlooking this view behind us. Truly. And to make it feel cozy, we still have that two inch walnut up on the ceiling and then great texture on the wall. So Love you it. get an intimate feel in here. Again, all about the views. <gasps> I mean, really, every corner, actually every corner has windows. Yep, and then the mirrors kind of double reflect the view, so wherever you look, you're getting that view. You're getting view. And I always think primary bathrooms are so important because it's, it's a ritual for us, right? It's where we start our day, it's where we finish our day, and to be able to do something like this where you're connecting with nature in every aspect, as you're brushing your teeth, as you're taking the shower even, yeah. you can see the view from there. Wow. It's, it's just very soulful to be able to do that. Well, and the light's always changing and the way it's reflecting off the mountains. Right? So it's, it's always something different. It's like watching a movie it, that you're in. Yes, yeah. I love stage. that. <laughs> it's like watching a movie that you're in. It really does feel that way. Yeah. It really does. I, I feel, it's weird to say, but I feel calm and relaxed in this house. Good. Yeah, it's well, let's so go, nice. Let's go glam it up a little bit. Okay. But... Yes, let's Can't do it. Can we go this way? <laughs> that way. Yes, yes. okay. <laughs> oh, it's so moody and this cool. This is the guy's closet here, right? Wow. Very Armani. Very Armani. Yes. And this is, I mean, you don't even have to know anything about anybody that lives here to know this is his closet. Yeah, and he's a great right? dresser, so. Mm -hmm. Very sharp. Very sharp. Yeah. Nicely I done. I love the mood. The mood is I just so I love the mood, nice. even the little detail of the spotlights right? that creates effect on the island. So cool. Sexy. It is sexy. Now we're going into every girl's dream. Oh, it's so beautiful. I and might even dream of this. And right? Bright. <laughs> Wow. Oh my gosh. And more views, of course. This is gorgeous. And then we have this really special love light fixture. I what love does it remind it. you of? Um, like a corset. Yes, exactly. So the homeowner, her family, in her family, there were dressmakers. Oh, wow. So this is really meaningful. It's a little reference to that that family history. Good design, good nice. design. Yeah, that's so nice. Really beautiful, everything she needs. Light, bright, you can see it. Oh, I love this closet. Mm. This stairway, to me, is a, is a sculpture in itself, oh right, my Anita? Gosh. I agree. And I love the way that it flows with our curved wall with the opal schist on it. So now you're up close to that texture. Wow. It just flows all the oh, way through. Oh, look how shiny it is. So yeah, beautiful. Yeah, it's got the little mica flex in it. Mm. As soon as you come down the stair, we got this little extra right over here. Wow. Okay. Okay. A little peek. A little peek. A little peek okay. into oh, a garage. Wow. Sure. A Where car you keep gallery? the keep the toys. Kelly, oh. you're not gonna believe this, but guess what the garage has? A view. <laughs> There's not one space that doesn't have a view. That's right. Right? Wow. And look at the lights. I love the little detail with the lights where they do a little radial pattern for the circular wall. Of yeah. course you do. As we do. Eight cars in here, oh, and then the auto court is above us. Wow. So we stacked everything. Oh, I understand. Okay, I'm getting it. Okay, really I'm getting a little incredible. thirsty. What about you? Okay. Should we see what might be out here? Yeah, let's go check okay. it out. <laughs> so stunning. I like the use of blue everywhere. Beautiful that blue, was blue, yeah. blue. And yeah. a client's favorite color. Okay. So definitely a theme throughout the house. Love so it's this beautiful navy leather, leather. And you even see a little bit of the blue hint in the travertine in the fireplace Stunning. and that horizontal veining. Love so. that, it's beautiful. But the real art of the room is this wine cellar. Right. <laughs> right? Incredible. So how many bottles of wine do you think that can hold? Uh, let's see, five, I'll say 500. Okay. I say not enough. <laughs> Always true. Right? <laughs> There's about 1,100 bottles of wine in there. Wow, okay, oh, I thought you meant when I was done having a party. <laughs> oh, okay, got it, right. Well, let's go check Incredible. out some more of the glam spaces down here. <laughs> Wow. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> so great. Oh it's my gosh. Always really fun to design for families yeah. and 
designing for this son and thinking about a, a space that can mature with him. Mm -hmm. When we started, he was still in high school, but planning to be an engineer. So you could see we had some fun with that Clearly. in what we did with the design. How cool is this and what inspiration? Here, again, a, an open corner, all glass, beautiful views. How do you not find the time or the mind space to study and become the best engineer possible? Yes. Well, it really? all happened in that little alcove right over there. But oh. then you've got total different privacy from what's up above. So he's got his own Incredible. space, his own little world. It's perfect. It really is. Incredible space. Really OK, nice so we've go. seen both levels. We're going to go back up because we're going to finish with something really, really extra. Let's do it. Really extra. Really extra. More than this. More <laughs> than this. I can't wait. All right, come on. Let's do it. OK, what? A little secret office, a little See, perch. Wow. Oh my gosh, look at the views everywhere. You can <gasps> see the Zen garden from up here, and then you can see out to the mountains on the other side. Oh, this is stunning. And this is always a challenge, because when you have a space with shelves, it means there's a certain amount of clutter, right? Just be, uh -huh, right? It, it comes along with the territory. But one thing that helped to keep it simple is we inset the shelves, yeah. the walnut shelves, into the wall, and then did it with this amazing wall texture that kind of, again, quiets the space. So one of the big debates in this room was whether we put a desk in here oh, or not. Remember? Yes, we did a few floor plans to decide which way should this be, and we ended up with this great little cozy lounge, okay. which works out yeah, well for us. He just him. sits on his laptop and he enjoys the, the game, and you know I think he wants to get away from work a little bit and just relax. You know, that is a really interesting thing. So the office without a desk, yeah. but you have got so many beautiful views, like why would you just like commit to just one, one view. Right. But you know what you always need in a yeah. space like this? Yeah. A place for a nap, yeah. which is yes. why we have the yes. long sofa. <laughs> you know what, you are right. Well, there really are some great gorgeous. views throughout this house, but yes. we have one more super duper extra view to show you. Okay, okay. okay. Right. Come check this one out. Of course, you have a deck on top of the house. Yeah, so from here we can see both airports, which was something our client wanted to see. Okay. And so at this vantage point, we have a 270 degree view, 360 if you take in the mountain. Yeah. And of course, you've got Camelback Mountain. There is your anchor. And it's really pretty desert right here. Yeah, All like the a beautiful vegetation. Yep. In incredible. Absolutely incredible. I mean, you just keep knocking it out of the park. I don't yeah. know how. You have a lot of great help. You <laughs> really do. Always. You really do. It's been a fun project. And this is an amazing spot on 4th of July, I can only imagine. I've never it been is. here, but. You see all of the amazing fireworks happening and all the municipalities around town. Yep. Well done. Thank you. This is fun, huh? So good. <laughs> it's so good, so good, as usual. Extra. You it's ladies are extra. extra. You too, Mark. Extra, <laughs> extra. It's very extravagant. There we go.